I'm from a large deaf family. I'm actually sixth generation in my family and my daughter is seventh generation deaf. Based on my experiences growing up and recognizing that home life and that nature versus nurture type of thing impacts the way kids learn helped me realize counseling was what I really wanted to do. I graduated with a major in psychology and soon realized I still yearned for more. So I became involved in the Miss DC America pageant. I was recognized and acknowledged for my abilities, which I knew would carry me through and for using the pageant as a platform to raise awareness of the needs and rights of the deaf community. Now, I didn't win the pageant, but it gave me the motivation to do more. Then I joined the Peace Corps, which led me to work at Kerugoya School for the Deaf. And at that time, the school was looking for deaf youth in the area to fill their residential program. Some of the kids were coming in at six, seven, eight, even 14 years of age with significant language deprivation and delays. At the moment, the school has counselors and social workers, which is pleasing and admirable, but there is still a need for more. Currently, there is close collaboration between the counselors, social workers, teachers, and parents in discussing and dealing with any issues being faced both at home and the school by the students through coordinated efforts. We have some students who have absolutely no language use at home, which means that due to a lack of social emotional interaction and familial bonds. They suffer from depression or esteem issues and this manifests itself in various forms. Some of the parents we interact with sometimes have not yet had an opportunity at acquiring literacy. It is in these moments when I apply my experience from working for the Peace Corps and life knowledge that I'm affirmed of my talents. I'm mindful to use my rapport building skills, including my lived experiences and world knowledge while living in Kenya and apply them to children's lives with the hope that they may thrive because they absolutely have the potential.